Hey there everybody, this is Ira and I am extremely excited to announce that the event 2, my, my second patron event, The Coaster, has now concluded. Everyone has finished building their coasters, the servers are closed for building, and it is time to start the judgment. Now, nobody else has done their judging yet, I'm gonna do mine first. I was on the purple team, the purple team is the simpletons team, I am not going to be showing you the purple team's coaster in this video. If you want to see the Purple Team Coaster, uh, you're gonna have to ride it. And there's good news, my friends. You do have to be a patron or a simpleton to judge the coasters and be part of the judging. Uh, but once the judgment is complete in a few days, I will be opening all the servers publicly so everyone will be able to come on and ride the coasters. That's right, everyone will be able to come on and ride these coasters regardless of whether you're a patron. So uh, look forward to that. Watch my Twitter, watch my Discord, keep an eye out for announcements so that you can come on and try these out. And then you can try out the purple server for yourself. Or you can watch some of the other judges uh, doing their judgment because there's going to be a lot of people judging. Everyone who participated in the event this time will have the right to judge the other team's coasters. So the categories are functionality, which is uh, whether it works as intended, aesthetics, technical achievement, originality, and funitude. Those are the five categories we'll be rating all of the coasters on, and we'll be rating on a, sc a scale of uh, one to five, with one being eh, not that great, and five being holy cow, holy cow, Holy cow, my goodness, that's amazing. Okay, uh, I am here at the server list because I haven't really looked at these yet, and I want to make sure I get the intended experience. So we're going to go in alphabetical order, so we're going to do the brown server first. And I am so excited to come in here, folks. You have no idea. All right, so here we are. This is the brown server, team brown server. Uh, I did jump on here, uh, actually, just briefly in order to add one of these buttons so that all of the builders can switch themselves to adventure mode since I've de-opt everyone. Um, this is a lovely little starting area. I like it. Looks like we have a bit of a view. So we can look out over the map. Now, I could very easily just jump off here, but presumably if I died, I would just respond back here, so that's fine. I want to know what this big black box is. I'm very curious. It looks like tracks are going just all over the dang place. I am excited. Let's go. Let's see what's in this house. So we get the brown flags. Very nice. Lovely building. A little architecture. We've got some doors here. Ooh. Woo! Scary. Cave sounds. Um, I think that's cave sounds. Alright, so we've got... Uh, this looks like an empty room. <laughs> Maybe they didn't get around to decorating everything yet. Uh, hopefully in here. I did warn everybody several times to make sure that everything was playable in adventure mode. So we've got a map! Looks like some map. Looks. Bleh, I can't words very well today, my friends. This looks like a map of the server. Very nice. And they've even got the black line around. Well done. Uh, because we do have quite a small world. Quite. It's a small world after all. Oh, oh. I'm so sorry for that, my friends. Step here to begin. I will in just a moment. Is there anything in here? Does not appear to be anything in here. Okay. I guess let's begin. And I am so excited. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, look at that. Look at that, folks. We got flashing lights. Look at it. We got some redstone. Points for technical achievement. Okay. I'm going to get into the cart here. Um, how do I actually start? Do I just move forward or... I'm not sure. I don't see a button or anything. I guess I just move forward. All right, I'm going to hit F1. So we can go through this as intended. Oh my goodness. Into the dark tunnel right away. Okay. A little bit of flashes to the outside. Whoa! Oh! <gasps> What? How did they do that? Oh, did they put like world border blocks down or something maybe? Wow, look at that view! Look at that view! We did- we, did, we do have a nice map to build on here, okay? Okay, round we go. Oh, there is probably gonna be a bit of lag because we're moving real fast on the coaster and the server can only do so much. Even though the servers are really small. Look at this, look at this tower. Are we gonna go up that? Oh, oh, okay, here we go, here we go. Oh, I can't turn my head fast enough. Here we go. Oh, this is a nice little... Well, just slowly, just slowly, lazily coming on down. Like this. Goodness. Oh, there is just... There is a bit of the frame lag, though. I apologize for that. I don't know how much that is gonna come through in the video. Some of it might just be uh, my computer trying to render so many things. Ooh, dragon head. Uh, because... Ooh! Water chunk... Uh, uh. We're on to the next thing before I have a chance to appreciate it. That is the problem with roller coasters. You move fast. You always move fast. There's always... There's usually not too much time to appreciate the beauty. Okay, up we go. Up we go. This is the one we saw from a distance. I like it. 
Sometimes I wish that the Minecraft minecarts would turn your head for you. Oh, oh, we've gone back down. We've gone back down. <laughs> Because sometimes it's, it's kind of tough to... Oh! Oh, we're going back up! <laughs> sometimes it's kind of tough to keep up with, with where you're going, you know? Oh, that was clever. I liked that. It was a little fake out. I thought I was going back down, and I'm going back up. Okay. It is amazing, too, because we all had the same map to work with. And everyone, I think, has taken it in a really different direction and used the terrain really differently. So I'm actually, like, trying to orient myself. Like, wait a minute, where on this map am I? I know this map really well. Because I've been- I've been building on this map for a month as well. Wow, this one really goes up a ways, huh? Ooh! Uh-oh! 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 Whoo! Down we go! Ho 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 ho! That was some tech right there. I am definitely seeing some redstone in here. Okay, ooh, ooh. Oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, that is cool! Oh, that must have taken ages to build. Wow! Are we going all the way to the bottom of the map or what? Goodness gracious. <gasps> water tunnel. Oh, I love water tunnels. Beautiful. What? Am I supposed to get out? Am I supposed to get out? Was I, uh... I'm not moving now. Okay. Okay. Gift shop. <laughs> is that the end? No, I don't think that's the end, because this is different. Press button for marine life. Oh my gosh, there's so much to take in here. Okay, hold on. Soft toys. Oh, this is adorable. This is adorable. I am worried about this this uh, minecart though, because that is gonna stay there. That is gonna stay there. I am in adventure mode. I can't. Uh, I can't take that. Gift shop. Items are in barrel top right. Feel free to take some. Aw. Items in here. What do we got? Salmon plushie photo key ring. Oh, I love this. I love this. Take an 8x8 photo, maybe. Splash potion of harming. No thank you to that. Bucket of fish. <laughs> 10 pounds. Fool's apple. Model fire. Oh, model fire sounds nice. It's It has suddenly uh, dropped in temperature where I'm living right now in Europe. And I'm freezing right now. So actually, 6x6 photo for 4 pounds. 8x8 photo for 5. Um, do I have to pay? Is there a way to pay? 5 gold. A diamond. I don't have any money. I don't have any money. I think I'll, I'll come back here later. Uh, maybe with some pocket money. Um, oh, I do love this, though. This is this is really lovely. It is it is a bit unusual to have the... Uh, to have the gift shop in the middle of the course. But what can we do? Can I break this? I can break it. Okay. Oh, but I can't go back out and get it. Alright, well, as long as I can break it, I think I'm gonna have to let Team Brown know... Uh, about that, because in adventure mode you can't place minecarts. Looks like you can break them, but you can't place them uh, once they're in your inventory. So I hope they're gonna give me a minecart. Okay, they do. They do give me a minecart. Uh, but maybe they meant to put something here to break it and they forgot. But what will happen here is we'll end up with a pile up. So I will have to give them a heads up and give them a chance to fix that. Press button for marine life. Salmon spawn egg. Oh, cool! Oh, they didn't put a button on it, though. There's no button. Oh, no, there's a button! Oh, it blends right in. Ha! Huh? I, just, I just put a fish into the water. Bye! I made you. I gave you life. Okay, okay. Um, let's keep going. Let's keep going. F1 again. Turn that UI off. Ooh. Oh, look, a turtle! We okay. I know where I am now. I know where I am now. Oh wow! They they did they use this map so differently from how. Uh, oh oh, they did it again. You sneaky cheeky little. Okay. Down we go into the earth. Into the earth we go. Uh. Is this water gonna gonna take me where I need to go? It's very slow. <laughs> was this was this put here on purpose? Or, uh, or do we have a, do we have a glitch in the system here? I am concerned. I do see tracks down there. I'm worried that maybe, uh, maybe the tracks got washed away by mistake. Because so I don't think this is going to put me on the track. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. We'll give them the benefit of the doubt. We'll give it a second. If need be, I will spawn in another one. But, uh, I'm worried. Maybe, maybe it'll put me on the track. Is it going to put me on the track? <gasps> go, 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 go! This is this is frightening though. I'm I am worried that uh, even if this is okay, maybe that is how it was intended to work. Uh, I am worried that uh, people might 
think that it's broken and get out of their minecarts. Oh, they've done it again here. Um, because I can get out of the minecart if I want to, but then I would be stranded because I'm in adventure mode. Whoa. Yeah, this is this is very slow. This is a very slow portion. Whoa. Okay. That wasn't my favorite part. I'm gonna be honest with you folks, it wasn't my favorite part. A lot of stuff in here was really, really cool. Um, but when it makes you think the coaster is broken, <laughs> it's not the best feeling. I hope there's gonna be a powered rail right here or something, okay. Ooh, we had just I thought we were stuck, it was just FPS lag. Um, okay. So this is the slowest roller coaster I think I've ever been on in my entire life. Hello diamonds. Hello diamonds. Let's speed it up, let's speed it up, I want a thrill! Through the mine shaft. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Look out, bat. I'm gonna smush ya. Oh no! Oh! Ah! <laughs> Very tricksy. Very tricksy. I appreciate that. I like the little fake outs and stuff. That stuff, that stuff I enjoy. That's cool. Here we go. So. Ooh! Ooh! I like that. That's pretty. That's pretty. There's some, there's some really pretty builds in here. I appreciate that very much. Let's... Okay, okay. We're going further down. This is quite a long coaster. This is quite a long coaster. I, when I was looking out at it, I thought maybe it was going to be a relatively short one. But, ooh. but it looks like they uh, they made it reasonably... Ah! What? Are you kidding me? This is another situation, though, where we're going to end up... Yeah, see, we've already got a minecart pile up here. I'm gonna have to suggest to them that they do something about that, otherwise that might cause some trouble. Okay, so this is... Summon the new minecart. Okay, it is summoning a new minecart. Wow, they built in the nether. I didn't even enter the nether on mine. Uh, the purple team, we did not enter the nether. I did not- it did not even occur to me to try to do something like this. They have really gone the extra mile here for this. Wow. Look how red the nether is. Goodness, is that new? I haven't been to the nether in this latest version of Minecraft. This is Minecraft 1.14.4, by the way. Latest version. Woo! Oh, wow. This is all extremely impressive, my friends. I think this coaster might be longer than my, than the purple team's coaster. And our coaster is pretty long. It is a pretty long. Are they going to have to send me back? Oh, yeah, here we go. They're going to send me back. Wow. Okay. I can get my, my thing back here. Uh, push button for cart. It looks like they teleported me here. Push for cart. Get in. Push for go. Go! Okay, here we go. Whoa! What? Ah! ah! Oh my goodness! <laughs> I was not expecting that! Wow! Okay. I think we can already say five, five, uh, five out of five for technical achievement. No doubt about that. I see a rainbow over there. I like rainbows. Am I going? Am I going toward? I think I'm going towards a rainbow. Get ready. The shooting gallery is up. The what? The shooting gallery. Points increased by prime numbers as you as you go up the rainbow. I, I've never used a crossbow. I don't know how to use a crossbow. <laughs> uh, what? What can I? Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to shoot anything. Did I, uh, did I shoot something? Nope. <laughs> oh my goodness. Are there any easier ones? I don't think so. I don't know how to use a crossbow. I don't think I'm gonna, uh, do very well here. Did I get that? Oh, I have to hit the button, don't I? Ah! I'm also getting too much lag. This is very, very clever, though. Are there any more? I don't know how, uh... Oh my goodness. Ugh, can I- I got one! I got one at least. Oh. There's another one. Ugh, missed that one. Is that it? The shooting gallery- okay, shooting gallery's over. That was very cool. That was really, really cool. Um, really difficult. The cart was going a little bit too fast. However... Score will be converted to emeralds for souvenir purchase. Hey, look at this! The end. Hit button to to retry. Hit button. No, I'm not gonna retry. 
Each point equals one emerald. Payment chest. Um, I don't know what to do here. I see a pressure plate and I see a button. And I see a whole load of... Chests full of stuff. Purchase rewards. Oh! I got four emeralds. I don't know what that button does. Early Larian mo- <laughs> Well, there's no prices listed on stuff, is there? There isn't. Is it- I'm not- I'm not sure, uh... How much to pay for stuff here. Let's see. Should I take something? Let's take a dead bush. Oh, one emerald equals- Okay, there is one here. One emerald equals one. Two emeralds equal. I mean, I don't really have a use for any of this stuff. Five, I can't get one of those. Can't get one of those. Yeah, no, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get anything cool. I only got four diamonds, or four uh, emeralds. 23, 29, 990, no thanks. Well, I've got four. So I can get um, an iron ingot. And a dead bush. I'll take that, I'm gonna take my prizes. Put my payment in here. Are you gonna stay? I think... There we go. <laughs> Figured it out. Let's go back to spawn. Um, okay, so that is Team Brown. That There was some really impressive stuff in there. I didn't love everything about it, but the, that doesn't mean that it wasn't good. So functionality, um, I'm gonna take off a point from functionality because there are spots where we're gonna get minecart pileups and I'm gonna have to let them know about that. So I'm gonna give them a four out of five for functionality. Uh, for aesthetics, I think, I think I'm gonna go with a four out of five for aesthetics. Um, there were some areas that were really, really, really nice, including this little spawn area. Uh, but there were also a lot of areas that weren't decorated and stuff. So four out of five was pretty good. Uh, Technical achievement, that's it, easily a 5 out of 5. Easily a 5 out of 5. That was, the, the tech stuff on here was very impressive. Uh, originality, I think I'm going to give them a 5 out of 5 for originality because the shooting range was a very clever idea. Going into the nether was a very clever idea. And then for funitude, I'm going to give it a 4 out of 5 for funitude. Um, most of it was very, very fun, but I didn't really enjoy the parts where you're just waiting for the water to push you around. That wasn't, uh, I felt that it was kind of meh. That was kind of meh. Um, but that's really it. The rest of it was, was very, very cool, and they did a great job. So, uh, Team Brown, congratulations. You have got, let's see, let's do some quick math, uh, 22 points, I think? I think that's 22 points. I'll double check it later. Um, out of 25. That is pretty good. It's pretty good. It's gonna be hard to take points away from anyone, my friends. <laughs> These are all my pages, and they all work so very hard on this. Um, they did a great job. Okay, let's jump off of the Team Brown server, and I'm gonna jump into the Team Yellow server. Alright, so I am uh, still in survival mode from when I was in here earlier, uh, setting things up when I first set up the server. So I'm gonna just uh, get out of creative mode, jump into survival- actually, not survival mode, I want adventure mode. Anyway, uh, this will send me to whatever their spawn point is. So here we go, yeah. Uh, so actually, game mode adventure. I am opt, of course. These are my servers. Ooh, we've got a nice star starting room here, and it's a good thing I did that, because I wouldn't have been able to get in here, otherwise would I? Okay, um, thank you for writing. The world's greatest coaster. Ooh, ooh, somebody's got confidence. Please leave 5 out of 5 star review on Ira Maps, and make sure to follow us on Ira Book and Ira Gram. Very cute. Uh, keep your arms and legs inside the minecart at all times. Yellow team does not bear any responsibility for accidental deaths. Hmm, okay, that's worrying. Normal mode, to start the ride, get into the cart and press the button below. Spooky Halloween month mode. Set your brightness to moody for this. I'm not going to do spooky Halloween month mode this time around. I'm going to leave that. If you folks want to come in here and check out spooky Halloween month mode uh, when the servers are open to the public, you go ahead and do that. I'm going to set normal mode. I am in the minecart, right? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh. <laughs> Is it going to work? Uh-oh. There we go. Press. There we go. Oh my goodness, we start. We just jump right into there. Okay. Okay. Uh, so we are, uh, this is Team Yellow now. Team Yellow. Very nice coaster. I like, ooh, ooh, we got some, we got some jack-o'-lanterns. I like the, uh, the dark wood there. That looks really nice. So we are going around the outside of the mountain, it looks like. One of the mountains. This is a really great map for making a coaster. 
I, I, I made quite a few different maps before I chose the one for this. Ooh, ooh, fancy, fancy. All those valuable things that I can't have. So we are hugging the wall here. Hugging the wall real tight. I might have to try spooky Halloween mode after. I'm getting curious now. They got all these jack-o'-lanterns everywhere. It is October now. <laughs> I really like this terrain. I know I keep saying that, but it's still true. Sometimes you just gotta say things a couple of times. Oh, hello, cows. Oh, look at them all tied up. Poor things. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> and there's some sheep. Hello, sheep. There are a lot of land. We are very well lit here. We're not gonna get any, any hostile mobs. Although, actually, these servers are set to peaceful mode, so that wouldn't happen anyway. Oh, this is nice. I like how it just kind of winds. Oh, look at the beautiful garden with all the turtles and the coral. Oh, bye. <laughs> Again, the problem with coasters, you never get enough time to properly appreciate stuff. Um, and I lost track of what I was saying. Oh, I just saw a painting and it was gone. It was gone before I had a chance to appreciate it. Wow, we are really, really using all of this mountain. I like that. There's there's a temptation with a map like this to try to cover the entire map, which is which is what the woo, <laughs> which is what the purple team did. We definitely used the whole map, uh, but sometimes if you just pick one area and just decorate it really well, that can work even better. And we have such a view, we can still appreciate the entire map even without necessarily using the whole thing. Are we gonna go all the way up to the top of this mountain? All the way up to the top. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, oh, okay. We're definitely going somewhere over there. I see more rainbow colors. I like it. I do love... Whoop. <laughs> this, is a, this is just a nice course. Okay, across the clouds and into the rainbow we go. Whee! Oh, I like this. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Are they doing the same thing? You people with your fake outs, it's frightening. Ooh, that was extra frightening. <laughs> I thought I might actually go over the edge. Is this going to make it all the way? I'm assuming everyone tested their coasters, right? But we've got some some turns to make here and I don't see any powered rails. Are we going to make it all the way to the powered rail? I think we are. <gasps> okay. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, and we're going in reverse now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> um. Hmm. At first I thought this was just lag, but I can see that lantern moving. This lantern is blocking me from going down, I think. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can break this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> let's let's just leave. Let's not let's not. Uh... I think it works now. I think it works now. <laughs> so we're gonna have this nice leisurely ride down back down now. Except it's gonna be really really fast. It's not gonna be leisurely because all these powered rails that were making us go up before are now sending us back down. Goodness gracious. Well, they're gonna have to- they're gonna have to lose a, a point for functionality there. Because if I hadn't been opt and able to jump into creative and break that lantern, I wouldn't have been able to get back down. <laughs> I wonder if somebody threw that lantern up there at the last second and, uh, and didn't test the coaster again. Oh dear, oh dear. Team Yellow. You made such a beautiful, beautiful track here. You gotta test. You gotta test everything. Gotta test everything repeatedly. Down we go. It's amazing how much you slow down uh, when you go around these little these little curves. Even though we're going downhill and at high speed, it still slows us down so much. We hello turtles. I love you. Bye. <laughs> okay. This, this coaster, assuming it just sends me right back to the start, this coaster is not um, as long as the other one. I'm tempted to try that spooky Halloween mode, if I'm honest, if we've got the time. We'll see. I don't know, maybe, maybe I should, you know, I will try it, but maybe I won't put it in this video. 
On the other hand, if I'm gonna make a fair judgment, I really should try both modes. They did make two modes and I should probably try both of them, right? So I think I will do that, actually. Why not, my friends? Why not? Oh, 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 we're gonna make it! Whew. <laughs> Through the waterfall. Around all these corners. Nice use of the bell there. Using the new uh, NPC village items. I keep forgetting about those. My, my co-builders on the, on the purple team put those on, on our map, and I just... I never remember that those exist. Woo! <laughs> Maintaining momentum. Okay. So. I'll go back in adventure mode. I could have just stepped on my button, I guess. Break this. Um, can I put this back in here? Because you can't place them. Can I? No. So, uh, that is another thing I need to make sure that Team Yellow is aware of. This is going to run out of minecarts eventually, because they don't stack. So, and you can't really easily uh, get it back on the track, so they might want to do that. Uh, take a look at that. All right. Let's try, let's, let's be fair. Spooky Halloween month mode. Set your brightness to moody. I hate, I hate doing that. There's going to be jump scares, and I hate jump scares. So let's put it on moody. You're not going to be able to see anything, probably, because of YouTube, uh... Ooh, it's already dark. Uh, YouTube compression darkens everything. We'll give it a shot. All right, push the button. <gasps> oh, it sets it to night! Oh, that, this is actually really beautiful. I'm glad that I did the second run. This is so much nicer in the darkness. Wow. This isn't spooky. When's the spooky part gonna come? Hmm? Hmm? Now, I am... I am especially curious, does the track change at all in spooky Halloween mode, or is it just, uh, just a little mood lighting? I really like, I really like the lighting. This is really lovely. Oh, it's beautiful! And the stars are out. Really, really well done. That was a very clever idea, and that is a very good way to get uh, extra mileage out of your work, too, because... Now I have motivation to do the same. It's, it's got replayability. This coaster's got replayability, at least a little bit. It's worth it's worth riding it at least twice. On the different modes. Hi, sheepies. I'm back. <laughs> and we'll see, of course, this time from the top. Assuming the track, assuming that the course itself is the same. Uh, we'll see if we can come back down properly this time. Hello! Use sea cucumbers in there. Light it up a little bit. This is a really, really beautiful track. Can I give them extra points? <laughs> Can I give them more than five points for the aesthetic? Maybe I should, maybe I should, um... Maybe I shouldn't give the ratings for each one... Uh, until I've ridden them all, right? Like, maybe I should go back and maybe... Maybe the other team won't get quite so many points for aesthetics now that I see what I have to compare it to. I'll have to think it over. It's not just me rating these, of course, my friends. Everyone who took part in this event is going to be tallying their scores. And we're going to average out the scores, and the uh, the one with the highest overall average scores will be the winners for each category. And it won't just be one team that wins, there'll be a winner for each category. So, probably everybody will win at least one thing. Everyone focused on different stuff. I wonder why that lantern blocked me before, actually. It does seem a bit odd. The other lanterns don't seem to be blocking me. I don't know. Uh! <laughs> it scares me every time! Look at that! Look how beautiful from up here! I almost wish that little bit of cliff wasn't in the way so we could get a nice view of the whole thing. Wow. Now I'm glad that this is so slow. Now I know it will make it will make it. I'll I'll make it all the way around. Um I'm glad we get a moment to appreciate this view. This is gorgeous. Here we go. No more being stuck. I didn't know that lanterns block your way. But apparently they do, because when I broke it, I kept moving forward. You got, you all saw it. You were all there. 
have you all as a witnesses. Well, I, I, I do have to tell you, uh, Team Yellow, this is not spooky. This is just really, really pretty. And I like it a lot. So unless you get a jump scare coming, and if you do, I'm going to be very cross with you. <laughs> You're going to lose funitude points if you get a jump scare. Um, assuming there are no jump scares, this is, um, this is really beautiful. In the dark mode. And I like it a lot. It's very relaxing, actually. The purple team, when we did ours, we really uh, just sort of went big. We weren't sure how much time we would have to put into any individual area. So we just made a huge, huge coaster that spanned the entire map, and we just decorated as we had time. And I'm, I'm quite happy with how it turned out in the end, but we didn't really quite spend this amount of care in any one specific area. And the difference is really... It's noticeable. And I like it. I think we're near the end now. Getting close to the bottom. Good night, cows. Good night, moon. Well, I saw the moon before. There you go. Good night, moon. Good night, pumpkins. Good night, lanterns. Good night, powered rails. Good night, unpowered rails. Good night, magma in the distance. Good night, dark wood planks under the tracks. Good night, diamonds. Good night, gold. Good night, emeralds. Good night, waterfall. I'm about to go through. Good night, flowers. Good night, campfire. Good night, bell. We just barely glimpsed for a moment there. <laughs> oh, this is so relaxing. I love it. I'm glad I did this one second, actually. It'll be nice and relaxed when I'm done here. And good night, coaster. Woo! Maintaining momentum. Um. I will have to talk to Team Yellow about this system and make sure that they're aware of potential issues with it. Or maybe I'll just leave that there. Maybe somebody can <laughs> get it onto the track there. Uh, I'm sure they'll come up with a way to, uh, to tidy that up. But I am... Hi, everyone. It's me. I didn't actually say hello to your faces. Hi. I don't want to hit anything. Because I don't remember if I change back to adventure mode. I don't want to break anything. Um, those are the two coasters. Uh, I've got to give yellow some points, don't I? So I, they, they do have to lose a point for, for uh, functionality because I got stuck at the top. So I'll give them four for that. Aesthetics is an easy five. Uh, tech, I'm going to give them a four. Not because uh, it wasn't technically sound, but just because, you know, relative to uh, the other team where they put so much work into tech. We, we, they can't get full points for tech. Uh, originality, I'm going to give them a four. Uh, it was nice. It was pretty. Um, but it wasn't It wasn't anything I hadn't seen before, really, for the most part. And Funitude, I think I'm going to give him a 5 for Funitude. That was... It wasn't exciting so much, as it was just really pretty and relaxing. And I, I appreciate that. You know, roller coasters don't have to be super crazy. I don't like roller coasters in real life, folks. <laughs> I don't like them. Um, and glancing at the list of scores here, that does look like they have a tied score for me. Each each team has got a 22 for right now. I'll think it over and decide if I want to change anything, but for now, I'm fine with giving them each a 22, and we'll have other judges coming on and, and checking things out and giving their scores, and then we'll see what the average is in the end. Once again, uh, in a few days, and watch for the announcement on Twitter or on my Discord, all of these servers will be open to all of you. Every single one of you will have the chance to come on and ride. So um, keep an eye on that so you don't miss it. And that's it for now. This is, this is already getting to be a little bit long, so thank you so much for watching, my friends. The next event will be starting in about a week, something a week-ish. Uh, I'll, I'll announce the exact date once I know for sure. Uh, the, next, the next one isn't, isn't prepared yet, so I'll be, I'll be preparing the next one. And remember, if you want to take part in this, if you want to be in these events, if you want to join a team, all you have to do is sign up to be my patron at patreon.com slash it's me Ira Lee. Five dollars and up is all it takes to get on the event servers, and we would love to have you here. Thank you so much for watching, my friends, and I'll see you next time. Bye! My patrons are the best. They are the best. My patrons are the best. They are the best. Best. Patrons. Patrons. Best. Patrons. Patrons. My patrons. Best. <laughs>